up and elaborate on how Prophet Terry really feels and stuff. The other day, kids, you people have taken all my friends elsewhere, or they have taken themselves elsewhere. I don't see those people anymore. And I, I just learned to come to acceptance that, you know what? Any time that I may have felt happy in my life, those days are behind me and shit. And like, oh, what about the future? Who fucking cares and stuff? For real. I miss the way things used to be and stuff. For real. Because now my life is just a stupid fucking rat race. Whatever happened to the days when I could run, skip, and jump and stuff? For real. It's not like that anymore, kids. There is no more running, skipping, and jumping. It's the stupid rat race and nothing. For real. And that's what's wrong with your capitalism, kids. That you people don't... You, you people say like, oh, well, ha, 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 stupid homeless man or whatever. At the end of the day, you people are going to like two years down the road be like, damn, I wish I could jump, skip and play and stuff. But you people voted for crooked capitalism and stuff like that. So I'm like, hey, kids, I don't know. Like, it, it, I just miss when things were more simpler, where I, I felt like I, I wasn't having to run for president. And... You know, when I first started running and stuff, where it's like, oh, well, I mean, God told me to run and stuff. So, like, we can't forget about that and stuff. But anyway, like, what happened to me the day before he told me to run? I was running, skipping, jumping, and playing, and just living life. This isn't life, kids. This is a stupid fucking rat race. That's going to get me nowhere in the long run except a claim to fame as a stupid presidential candidate. And at the end of the day, I knew that's what it was. But at the end of the day, you kids be like, oh, he's partying and he's living it up and having a, a cake and shit. You may see that from time to time, kids. But there is no fucking cake here now. I got $2 and quarters. And I'm going to make that last me all night. So, like, I don't know how I'll get by, but I guess I'll manage. At the end of the day, kids, let's not forget this is for God and it's not for you kids. I'm not here for your fucking entertainment. I'm here to give you kids a warning from God that he's extremely pissed at you people for all these wars and all the shit you kids voted for and supported and stuff. You people, like, I'm not even going to start with you kids. Anyway, like, I'll cram this in with the one before. Like, your stupid police state. I can hear ambulances, a, a sick howling sound in the background. You can't see them, but you know they're there. Like your national debt, you can't see it, but it's, it's there, because... No, it's down, two avenues down there. There it goes. Mind you, if somebody's spraying leg or dead, why do I need to hear about it two avenues down? So, like, anyway, kids, anytime I brought that up, you people said, oh, well, crazy homeless man shit. So I'll tell you what, kids, anytime you kids start hating those sirens, you're fucking crazy, too. At the end of the day, I told you kids, you didn't have to vote for that, and you voted for that anyway, and you talk shit about the only person who talks shit about the sirens, which was me and stuff. You people had nothing nice to say to me. You people won't even let me have any claim to fame, whether it be prophet of God, all seeing eye, um, presidential candidate, or um, just anything else that I may want to add on. You people be like, no, no, no. Uh, quiet down and settle down and get a job at McDonald's for $12 an hour. Uh, come down here, Hillary Clinton. For real. You owe me $5 million, bitch. I'm not working at McDonald's. For real. That's why I left Wisconsin Crooked Hillary. For real, bitch. No, I wanted more for myself, and I'm still expecting it. Your economy is a lie. It doesn't let hard workers like me push ahead and succeed. It only, it only only people that get ahead in life are you crooked billionaires and crooked senators and stuff. Come down here, crooked governors. Come down here, crooked mayors, and, and uh, share some of your net worths with me and stuff. Uh, look up your mayor's net worth online, kids. And if it's not online for viewing, uh, you need to call them up and ask why it's not on there. And then I want all politicians to put their tax returns on there and stuff like that. Come down here, crooked bitch Hillary Clinton. Vote for me, America, Terry 2020, in your rigged election.